Right, so now, I know you can't turn it off, but how does it feel to ride a motorbike that you guys have made? It's unbelievable. I can I only imagine. It's, um, yeah, it's not something we dreamt of. It's actually, yeah, you can't believe it. Yeah, see, this is the PZ 419. It's off its way. It's on its way to the roof of Africa this year. Be dream peace. We're going to interview him at the roof. Give him lots of attention. This is a very historic South African made motorcycle. Wim Chris, hang on, you're not allowed to. I'm going to ask you a question. Yes, sir. How does that feel? Ha! <laughs> Absolutely. It's unbelievable. Every single one of us. We yeah. watched this from the beginning. We had our doubts as to whether you buggers would put it off. Never but the proof it. is in the pudding. Look at this, eh? Yeah, never doubt. Well done, it. sir. Unbelievable. Go to peace! <laughs> Guys, for the last few months we've been telling you about this PZ490. I'm going to show you what it looks like there. They've done the decal kit for it and it looks it looks absolutely factory. This is Rimpiece. How are you, sir? Hi, I'm very well, thank How you. How many roofs have you done? I think it, uh, it must have been like six. I'm this will sure. be number? Seven. Number yeah, seven I must now. just double check that number, but it's some, somewhere along there. Brilliant. Tell so me. So I've got my roof cap, 2004. I That's saw the that. First one. Very cool. I've got yeah. some that are much older than that, oh, so sorry. stop showing off now. Okay. <laughs> Listen, just a quick one. I'm going to show you their shirt. This is their logo. Guys, you have yes. to go and look for these guys at Roof. Go and have a chat. This is an amazing piece of technologies. R Rimpy, you ride a, a, a 300. It yes. was a 300. Now yes. it's a 500. I know yes. you've only had it running for about a week. How yes. does it feel? It's unbelievable. No, it's really, it's something different. It's the lowdown talk is so much different. It's just, yeah, it's, uh, I'm still getting used to it, just trying to sort out everything. So it's really something else. And you take it out to the rocks this week? Uh, next week. Next week. Next okay, week, so honest. I'm going to take photographs of your exhaust pipe prior to <laughs> going out to the rocks. And when you come back, I'm going to take a picture of that pipe Before again. And, after. <laughs> and then we'll have a discussion about it. Yes. I'm Listen, sure. guys, absolutely amazing. We look forward to seeing you at this year's Roof of Africa. Thank you very much. Chris, very quick. Donovan, Hello. hold your horses. This is more important than TV. Guys, we're going to have a full expose on, um, on, on Don's TV show. So watch out for that, the bike show. Chris, how does it feel? Well, it feels amazing. I mean, I'm so overwhelmed, but I normally, you know, I get like big emotions and I'm still waiting for the emotions to hit me. It's huge. I think tonight when you go home and you've had yes, that sir. first scotch, it's going to kick in. Yes. Unbelievable, sir. Fantastic. We look forward to seeing you guys at Roof of Africa. Thank you very much. So I just want to show you guys so you've got an idea. These are all plastic molds of all of the components that have been manufactured and fabricated to create something that actually runs this KTM frame. And I just want to show you the artwork that goes into like that exhaust pipe, for example. You can see over there, it's, it's pretty, pretty damn spectacular if you ask me. Um, so this tells me that these oaks need to get a real day job because I don't know how they find the time for this kind of thing. But uh, yeah, we'll see them at the roof of Africa. This is really, really something to see.